Hi there, this is Abhishek and in this video I will talk about uh, one of the features in my previous videos we have talked about is the alert and uh, that is basically based on the three events that are on open, on post reload or on post reduce and that is something whenever you are opening the document you know the event will be fired and whenever you are reloading the document then the event will be fired and on post reduce that means when you are reducing the data with the help of uh, reduce data within which is present in file then you know it should fire an event but what if, if your need is that uh, based on the selection that I'm making then I need to show some pop-up to my user so to do that uh, there is a custom way that uh, uh, you know people uh, do or at least we have done it that whenever I'm selecting based on my selection uh, the pop-up is coming and then if the condition is satisfied and if the condition uh, does not match then it is uh, going away so what you can do is you can right click over here uh, go to new sheet object and go to text object and you will say that uh, sales is less than 1 million for this region so that's the standard example i have been using so i will just give a simple text however you have the option of adding interactivity as it is a expression field and so far if you have if you are following my videos you know how to do that so after this uh, what you need to do is go into the layout and here is the key that you want to show it always or you want to show it conditional so what I want is I want to show it whenever the sum of sales is less than 1 million I click, click apply okay all right so here in this case I think the sale is definitely more than a million because the furniture category itself is going I think more than 1 million in this case so let me select the Northwest Territories where we know well in advance that the sales is less than 1 million. So that's a good testing scenario. So let me click over here. And here you can see that uh, pop-up is appearing. So it is not good that uh, the way it is appearing. It should display it on top of this chart. So let me right click go to the properties and within the layout let me change the layer to top and click ok now it is coming over here and let's make it a little bit transparent uh, so that user is able to see <coughs> the the background of bars and let me change the color to make it a little bit dramatic or let's make it red to make it a little bit dramatic and uh, so that user is basically getting oh there is something uh, problematic about this so that's the transparency uh, let's make our font a little bit big bold and white should be good Click okay all right sales is less than 1 million for this region so I think that's pretty cool because if I select any other region so here in this case you can that it is appearing as you can see so that way uh, you don't really have to uh, wait for or you know depend on your events like it is present over here but you have created your own custom event and whenever the user is interacting with the document then only then itself it is they are getting the notification so that's about it uh, for this video and i'll meet you in the new video the new topic